Hey guys, it's me, Mr. Cheese Gaming here, and welcome back to more of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Last time, we used the Chrono Trigger to revive Chrono, and here we are in the final chapter of the game, and take a look at how long this chapter is. I, most of my videos, I usually split the chapters in one or two videos. Yeah, to look at the video title and see that it is the first part of a series of 10 describes just how long the chapter Faded Hour is exactly. I'm gonna go ahead and reorganize my team if we talk to Ayla right here. Chrono, Chrono, Chrono. Fight levels, strong armor, Ayla village have, go see. Ayla go, boring here. Ella fight hard. Too much. No fight. We're gonna have Ella run the team. And you know what? Next we'll have, let's say, talk to Fog. Yes, damn it, I'm about night. Could it be? Yeah, everyone will have their own, um, hand about their own side quest. Also show you where you would need to go. My generals, so they let still live. As they did maintain a fortress in the style of my own. Keep, I wonder. Um, you know what? Let's bring Frog. Oh, right. You can no longer talk to them to recruit them. Except for Ayla, apparently. Okay, let's have Frog and Robo in our party. Actually, let's see what, just to see what Luca and Marl have to say. Cellular energy was reused eons ago, long before Lavos was discovered as a source of power. That's true, um, which is kind of, which is really kind of funny, um, in our world, in real life, um, solar power is still relatively new. Here, apparently the it was used in antiquity until they replaced it with Lavos. It may just be the thing we need to combat him. Huh. A bit of old versus new in that aspect. Father, I wonder how you're doing now. Ah, oh, come on! <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and use the Epoch. Nice to be able to play with a Chrono in our party. First things first, let's start off with Ela's. Epa, go. Let's start off with Ela's side quest. She said that she had a powerful ar armor. Let's go ahead and talk to the elder. Very strong armor. Use many rubies. Trade it for petal, fang, horn, feather. Ten each. Basically, she he would want us to get as ten of each item, and he'll make one vest. But before we go to the hunting range and collect said items, talk to this new here. What? What the matter? I was sound asleep, new. Can't a, can a new not get some rest? I changed Ayla's name, so please let me go back to my dreams, new. He'll change the name of whoever is in the front of the party. I'll keep Ayla as the default name, although I might change Frog to Glenn and make us to Giannis. Nighty night. Oh, I forgot. I don't need this stone, so I give it to you. Silver gemstone. That I believe that activates a dual tech. No way, a triple tech between uh, what characters? All right, it would actually be equipped as accessories.
Black Stone. Eternal Darkness Triple Tech, which is, I believe, with Robo, Magus, and Luca. I believe that's what it is, the Eternal Darkness. And Silver Genstone, Spin Strike Dual Tech. Ah, that's Ayla, Frog, and Robo. That's, that's right. That's why I have them grouped together like that. Anyways, it's just a matter of going to the hunting range and fighting all the enemies and then trying to get new to appear. So, I think I'm gonna go ahead and cut that out for you guys. Okay, took forever, but I finally got all of them. The horns especially took forever to get. And, guess I wasn't really horny today. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, because take a look, um, after all that, yeah, only one horn left. Incidentally, we got in, um, 99 feathers at one point. But take a look, we now have... Ruby armor for everyone. Equip them, and also reduces fire damage by one fifth. Lower Robo's um, magic defense um, a little bit, but that shouldn't matter too much. I guess same for you. It wouldn't do much good for Luca. Well, actually, it would do very good for Luca um, once we do her side quest. And pretty much, I only care to do one more thing. Really? Oh, La Ruba of Ruins. I was... <laughs> Wrong area. Frog's name the same. And you know what? I'll do the same for Magus. I'll do the same for Magus. Even though that I'm gonna end up calling Magus Giannis occasionally because, I don't know, I like the name Giannis much more than Magus. But anyways, that's pretty much it for Elon's side quest. Very, very short side quest. But, other side quests um, may lurk before we take on the Black Omen, which incidentally does not exist in 65 million BC, which makes perfect sense. So, next time, we'll take on Luca's side quest. Alright, see you guys then. And of course, I forget to do my outro. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you want to see more videos from me, go ahead and subscribe. Feel free to leave behind a comment. Okay, for real this time. See you guys in the next video where we'll take on Luca's side quest. See you guys then.